Hello and welcome back to Fallout 4. My name is Lumen and we last left off. We had just finished up the Automatron DLC. And the whole thing with the mechanist, that was a misunderstanding. It was never meant to be that way. She was just trying to help. And the robots, well, they had other plans. Right now we're going to do something that hopefully doesn't involve any robots. No Ada, no Jezebel, nothing like that. We're going to head to the old highway and we're going to do so with dog meat in tow. It's been too long. Okay, and I actually spent the one point that I had in my perk chart here on Lone Wanderer just because I wanted to take 30% less damage and increase my carry weight even more. Hmm. On third level, you can do 25% more damage as well. That is actually probably the best way to fine-tune to min-max the whole sneaky sniper build, right? Because if I get, like, Lone Wanderer 3, Sneak, obviously, Mr. Sandman, Ninja, and then I get myself a silenced weapon, obviously including Rifleman and all the rest, that's going to be a lot of damage. By the gods. I can't wait. Dog meat is also... As you can see right here, patiently waiting for some dog armor. <laughs> I know I've actually never spoken about that before, but I was sent a message recently and I was told, Listen, I know you're going to the old highway to meet Deacon soon because you got the quest in your log. When you do so, go... They said up and left from the Rocky Narrows Park, which fortunately enough I have explored. So like here somewhere? Not past the highway. Here somewhere. And I'll find a cave with dog armor. That sounds amazing. I'm not even sure what the dog armor looks like or how it works or whatever. But, I mean, look at that face. He's keen. This dude's up for anything. So let's do it. Let's proceed. Also, I was just looking over there. Now I see what killed me. The one time I just blew up there. I just, I didn't know. I thought it was like some suicide mob or something, but... Oh, that's the culprit. A frag mine. Wait, didn't I clear these dudes out? Look, I swear. I killed the raiders. That were chilling at this grave. And you know what? I'm not going to do it again. Shame. I kind of felt bad the first time around. I don't want to <laughs> relive that experience. Oh. So, it's quite exciting to finally be moving on from... The whole Automatron thing. Automatron was amazing. It was a really good piece of DLC. And I am obviously also very excited for the final DLC. I don't know if it's going to be the last one ever for Fallout 4 or whatever. But it's the final one for the season pass. At least. It's called Far Harbor. If I'm not mistaken. And it looks... At least... From first glance... Like it could be amazing. I'm excited. But, as I was saying, it's nice to be moving back to the stuff that I've been waiting to do. I want to explore the factions of the Wasteland. I want to get to know them. We're going to start with, right here and now, the railroad. And after that, I actually had both quests tagged, but I just deselected the Paladin Dance one. After that, we're going to go down here. Uh, down here. To the Cambridge Police Station to meet up with Dance. George Clooney of the Wasteland, and we're gonna, hopefully, do some good with him. I don't know. I'm actually very interested in, in seeing and hearing what he has to say and show me or whatever, because the whole Brotherhood of Steel thing, I'm conflicted about them. The show of force when they arrived in the Wasteland was a little excessive. They seem to be the rule with an iron fist type of faction. This is the place. Is that the cave? That doesn't look like a cave. Oh! Okay, this is probably the cave. Okay, here's another one and another one. Did I, did I seriously just miss all of that? Oh. My. God. Where's he going? Well, 
That was obviously the smartest one in this pack. <laughs> he just ran off. Is he gonna come back? So is this a spot? I don't see any armor here. Oh. Oh, I do. That's a dog helmet. And that's some dog armor. And a chain dog collar. Okay. Dog meat. Get over here. I have something for you. I'm so glad that you guys told me about this. It's amazing. At least I hope it's going to be amazing. I hope it's not going to be like... Disgusting. Maybe it turns him into one of these wild mongrels. No thanks. Hey. We'll see. I'll be the judge of how cool this is in just a second. Dog armor. Dog helmet. A helmet. I wasn't expecting that. I thought maybe like a little doggy harness or something. So you'll just look dapper while walking around the wasteland. But this seems to be, well, much more extreme. Equip. Oh my god, spikes and everything. <laughs> I hope it's comfortable. Okay, I hope it's comfortable. Because that's actually the most important thing to me. Are we going to put the ghetto dog collar on as well? Look. The collar actually has... Well, absolutely nothing going for it. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, but it suits the armor. Okay, that's cool. Although... I don't know, I like the bandana. Now, let's, let's put that on. We go full Robocop mode here on dog meat. Wow. Wow. Look at the spikes on his head. This is amazing. He's ready for battle. Where is that wild mongrel? I want to have like a little pit fight with the two dogs. I know that sounds like terrible, but it's a wild mongrel and it's dog meat. Dog meat's up for it. The wild mongrel, he just needs to die. So... I think it's okay. In this specific situation, I condone dogfighting. In no other situation would I. Ever. At all. There's something going on here. Oh, great. It's Deacon. Wait, did he have a hat on before? <laughs> well, I put an end to that fight. Okay. Oh, wasn't he supposed to be like the master of disguise? Deacon, I'm busy here, man. Gunners. Focused, agitated laser pistol. Lock and load. What? That was a beautiful shot. Deacon, is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander camo. This is my pile of garbage, asshole. Back off. Good, right? <laughs> You're lucky I didn't do one of my face swaps, too. Face swaps? I'm scared to even ask, but I'm going to. You can change your face. I put myself under the knife every year or two. New face, new body, you know, the full makeover. It keeps our enemies guessing. Look, I'm, I'm glad I can't follow up on that one, because that's messed up. I almost didn't recognize you. That's the point. So, about the job. The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. I found the entrance to that place, didn't I? Didn't I? Your base was under a donut shop? That's awesome. It's a lot better than it sounds. <laughs> it was. Awesome. Until it was blown to hell. Uh, sounds really bad. That sounds really, really bad. It was a disaster with a capital D. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. Okay, let's just hear about this something important. What exactly are we looking for? I'll tell you when we get inside. Oh. I know that's a bum deal, but strategic ignorance has saved our organization more times than I can count. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump him for information before we dive in. For now, I'll take point. So I'm looking for rail signs. 
Symbols we use to send messages to each other. If you like that, we got signs and countersigns, dead drops, even a secret handshake. All right, maybe the handshake never got on. Anyway, the tourist should have a trail left for us. Okay, why Here is he calling it a tourist? Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. So our tourist is up ahead. Let's keep going. Tourist. I get the feeling whatever we're going to get in there is going to seem very unimportant to me. And that's the reason he's not telling me up front, because I'd be like, hell no. Not wasting my time on that. I it didn't seem like I need to sneak at all. Dog meat. Got another rail sign. Right there. One of these two are tourists, maybe. <laughs> I hope not. I hope not. Where's the other rail sign? I've apparently missed it. Yeah, you can hand. Oh, okay, maybe you can't handle these. Okay, so the skills came with the outfit. I wanted to see how he handled that. He did good. That was fine. Ooh, I actually want to see dog meat fight something. Probably close. Yeah, that says up ahead. Did I just bump him in there, or did he... Oh, he ran in, okay. Never mind, never mind. Does he need help? I don't know if my mission is to protect him, or just to follow him and let him do his thing. I'm not even certain how it works. Like, I don't know if, if quest NPCs can die. If this is maybe like a, a proper escort quest or whatever. I don't know. At the end of the day, it doesn't really matter. Oh, Deacon. That outfit. It actually looks like a Minuteman outfit to me. See the plus in the center? That means there's an ally nearby, our tourist. You take point on the conversation. Look, no matter what he says, you just say, mine is in the shop. Trust me. All right, can I just go in here first? Mine is in the shop. 10 millimeter pipe. No thanks, no thanks. Stim packs, yes please. No thanks. I love being selective. Looting is so much easier nowadays. Alright, so, shall I put my sweet talking get up on? The dress and the other right arm. The formal hat. And the black room glasses. Oh! Uh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, have they changed it? I can't put the other right arm on anymore. It doesn't matter. Whatever. Dress is fine. Dress will do. What's up, buddy? Ricky Dalton. Hey. One of the Dalton brothers? Hi. Oh, thank God. You have a Geiger counter? You have a goddamn Geiger counter? Whoa, man. Whoa. Mine's in the shop. Mine is in the shop. Who the hell is he? HQ said they were sending one agent, not two. Sorry, I'm new. She's just showing me the ropes. All right. The wall is my witness. I thought I was dead. It's about goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here. Should I say you're safe or ask for a status update? Let's just go with this. It's all right. We're here now. You're safe. You think I'm goddamn safe? That little slocum Jones of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dome and sons of bitches! The front's fortified to hell and back. They place mines all over the goddamn place. Chrome domes. What do you mean by chrome dome synths? You know, them early model synths. Looks like metal wrapped over mechanical innards. You see them here and there doing who knows what for the Institute. Okay. What about the mines? Wait, they have a minefield? Yeah, the mother of all minefields. I couldn't draw you a map if I tried. I appreciate all you've done. I hope it helps. I really do. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, better ask soon. 
I really don't. Why are you all the way back there now? Is it time for a private conversation? <clears throat> well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? You think he's telling the truth? Yeah. I think so. He doesn't strike me as the dishonest type. Yeah, that's my read too. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So, if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So, we're going in through the escape tunnel. <sighs> I like how he's trip feeding me the information. The donut shop has an escape tunnel? What? Doesn't everyone have an escape tunnel? Seriously, though? Thank God for that tunnel. If it weren't for that, there wouldn't be any railroad left. Okay, let's take the tunnel. The tunnel has got to be easier than a frontal assault. Easier, but no cakewalk. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. Okay. Is this like an evaluation? Feels like it. Uh... Let's get everything back on that needs to be on. Put the patrolman sunglasses on. I can just look at myself and I'll know. There you go, that's perfect. Absolutely perfect. So where is this escape tunnel? Am I just not seeing it? Oh! That's, it's like right there. Interesting. Okay. That shouldn't be a problem. Can we... Ooh, crap. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> How do I always die like this? Seriously. Oh. In the most ridiculous ways. The boss comes, I live. A swarm of baddies run you at me. Else? No, I'm done. But whoa, sniper fire! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is this? Yeah, maybe I need something else. Hold on. Hold on. No, actually, I don't want him to do that. Shame. He's probably gonna die. But as I was saying, I always die in the worst possible ways. Do I have to actually run all the way around again? I guess. Seems like it. We can just sprint. Come, you two. Let's go. Chances are there's another way down somewhere here, but after what just happened, I don't particularly want to risk it. I would rather just hoof it all the way around, drop down here where I probably won't die. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay. Probably won't die. And then I'll just follow the little compass at the bottom here to my quest objective, because I'm good at this game. Clearly. I know what I'm doing. Q says there's nothing. Hoof, hoof, hoof. Wonder if the escape tunnel comes out in like a. I don't know. In a trailer? There was a trailer over there with the master lock. Where is that? Oh no, okay, this is actually legit. A tunnel. <laughs> okay. Not was I, that's not what I was expecting. I didn't think that they'd hide it. The tunnel in a tunnel. Could I have gone in here before hey, starting the quest? The back entrance is safer, but be ready for Gen 1s and 2s. So it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Carrington. Okay. Eager to go. Who's Dr. Carrington? All goes well. You'll meet him soon enough. What can you tell me about the Gen 1s and 2s? The synths didn't start off as nigh-perfect copies of human beings. The Institute had to work up to that level of hubris. Gen 1s and 2s were stepping stones along the way. The Railroad's not fully united on how we feel about them. Well, if they shoot us, we should probably shoot back let's find a prototype then together with you i like our odds 
first step is to override the security lockdown. All right. This guy just has an air of David Duchovny about him. That's just what I'm. That's what I'm feeling here. A master terminal. Oh my God! Am I ready for this? I, I don't think so. We're gonna try it anyway. Like a couple of guesses, and I should have it done. Yeah, I'm getting a few of the duds removed. Maybe it'll be easier than I thought. Oh yeah, okay, if this keeps going the way it's going, it's gonna be much easier than I thought. Whoa, whoa, whoa! No! Remove the duds! Remove the damn duds! Okay, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We got a 50% chance. Oh no, there's four try. That's like basically a 50% chance. Uh, let's take charismatic. Likeness zero. In such a long word. My brain's gonna explode. There's so many litters everywhere. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. I'm just, I'm just, like, jump in between them quickly. I'm trying to look at, like, the A's, the O's, the E's. Wow, I mean, these are some vastly different words. Okay, so let's go for one with it. T at the end? Are there any with... No, there's only one with a T at the end. How did they do... There's two with T's. Okay. Okay. So, let's go for one of these two. Then if it's a... If it's a one likeness, then maybe it's easy. Let's go for Bombardment. I didn't check. <laughs> maybe Bombardment actually has a... Bombar. Charismatic. Attic. Ugh. Well, okay, look. It's likeness zero, then we know it's not unimportant we know it's not lobotomize oh that was a good one okay you see because there's an o there there's an o there the second o uh there's a t at the end of this one there's a t at the end of this one but we tried bombardment right yeah bombardment atmospheric that's got a C at the end, as does Charismatic, so it's not that. Overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. Okay, that could be it. Oh, snap. So it's Devastation, Technicians, Embroidered, or Immediately. They're all zero likeness. Oh, and it comes down to this. This is my final answer. So I'm gonna I'm gonna have to work it out quickly. All of them thus far have been likeness zero. So, uh, devastation. I'm quickly comparing it. I tried overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. There are no likenesses between that and that. Okay. Let's try Overwhelmed to Bombardment. Uh, no. Devastation to Bombardment. Devastation. It could be Devastation. But then Charismatic to Devastation. Let's see. The A is too far along, it's not that. Oh, but there's a T there. Charismatic. Also not. Sweet. God. Oh. My heart can't take the suspense. That was on my last try as well. Man. I did it though. That's a master 
terminal hacked. You're not going to say anything about that, Mr. Willis? <laughs> oh. Something happened here. Someone left a rail sign here. Uh, this one means danger. Yeah, we know. You poor dead bastard. We know. I don't see the rail sign. Or did he accidentally not come down this way? Oh, that's the one that means danger. Thanks, Roger. Thanks. <laughs> uh. Damn. Yep, poor dude. There's a synth down here. Is. Don't say anything. Just don't. Oh, what is this now? The Institute. Maven made it a little further than Roger. Good girl. See the box in the center of that rail sign? That means there's a cache nearby. Looks like Maven managed to hide something before... You know. Yeah, I Look know. Around. Okay, well, like, way around this way? Tinker managed to turn on the defenses. Barely slowed the coursers down, but... Hey, probably saved some lives. I don't think you've ever seen a courser, but they're top of the line in Institute. Let's fuck up your day tech. There shouldn't be any coursers in here, but if there are, just run. I'll take a courser on, don't worry. Well, that's it for the synths. I want to go and find this alleged cache. It's got to be this way. Oh, okay. Well, that wasn't very hard to find. <laughs> uh, pipe. No. Okay. Great. Thanks, Deacon. Thanks. You've been a good guide thus far. Whew, this one doesn't have a turret control. A lock on it. Deactivate. Shutting down, thanks. I don't need to do the spotlights because I really don't care. Seeing that I've already killed everyone. I think I'll be okay. Funny music playing here. Really funny music. For an underground slog through the sewers on a railroad mission. It's just not what I'd expect. Like, I'd expect something more serious. This music actually sounds happy at times. I'm just doing this for good measure. Because I want to. Wait, so how long have these people been lying here? These look like fresh kills, right, dog meat? Right. I wonder if they've... What was that? Got any mines down here? One of my least favorite things in this game. On the plus side, at least, as it stands, I can walk over a mine without triggering it. I think Dogmeat might be able to as well. I'm not sure how Dogmeat works. Another active terminal. We didn't have time to trip the defenses up ahead. Power them up, and we can give our friends a little surprise. Movement detected. Yeah, there's a synth nearby. Just activate it. Let's Movement see if this can... Detected. Curious. can deal with him. Yeah, don't worry. Deacon, 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 Deacon. Don't worry about it, man. Fine, you know what? He wants to be the hero here, obviously. Yeah. Oh my god. Some of my shots are so precise, they scare me, and then some of them... <laughs> oh, some of them... Kelly K? Okay, well, that's the R&B artist. That just sounds like an R&B artist name. Of the railroad, obviously. They come in all shapes and sizes. Listen, we're just going down and down and down. Oh, but I think that in the Slocum's Joe, there was an elevator, right? So I guess the going down thing makes sense. This is one of those places where you expect something to just drop down right now. 
and surprise you. Oh, this looks like the base. This looks like it. Oh, novice. Thank God. Oh, this is so nice. Okay. <laughs> I just I just wanted to do that quickly before starting on these. Tries reset. Uh I might have clicked on the same one twice there, I just don't even know. It should remove the ones that uh, you've clicked on already. C come on, come, come on, don't joke around with me right now. Here we are. That's better. Oh, likeness to deeds. Okay, we can we can just figure it out based on that. Likeness to deeds. It's probably the two E's. Holds. Deeds. Hold. It's probably holds. I'm through. Okay. Open. That was fine. That was fine. 